Hello and welcome back to GBA Let's Play, where we play the jewels and the junk of Nintendo's most advanced system. We are back in the Legend of Hobbit today. And I'm, yeah, I'm just going to keep referring to it as Zelda. Because it really is just Zelda. Ah, Mr. Baggins, these walls are blocking a path. See if you can burgle something that can clear them away. Search the ruins. Sure. We need to search the ruins to the north. All right. Push this over there. There we go. There we go. I do like that there's more to do is, than just, like, walk and eventually get captured by elves. But, so, you know. Wow, this is really kicking my ass. <laughs> Up here. Oh, hey, you can do short jumps. You found Tinder and Flint. Alright. Oh, there's more ruins to the south. Uh, dang, these walls are blocking our path. Ah, but if I use Tinder and Flint... Hmm. Hey, there's somebody across the water that I can't get to. Okay. I have a feeling I'm going to visit there, so... Nice. Still no idea what those things are. I have, a, I have a feeling that they're, like, ammunition for some weapon that I don't have yet. That's usually how these kind of games go. I also like the sort of, you know, day to night transition, or day to, or, you know, rain transitions. It's not a lot, but it does add something to it, certainly. Like that. that. This is so fucking Zelda. Hey! Our search requires light. Can you use your tint and plunder on those two braziers? <laughs> sure. I mean, I think dwarves and hobbits both have low light vision. I'll never forget your tint and plunder comes in handy on adventures. Like 
that. Take that. I am Bilbo, destroyer of evil. Seems to have done something at least. Okay, where did that open something somewhere? Not that way. I guess I must have opened the door back here. Nope. Yep, yeah, okay. I wish I had more firecrackers. <laughs> okay. This should work on those walls. You're some use to us yet, burglar. Those thunderclaps you found should clear the path. Try using one now. gonna backtrack a bit because there was something else that I wanted to try. Here we go. Okay. That. There we go. Oh, I can just jump down there. Okay, how about... That's... this is not working. Okay, that didn't work. Got it. Nope. Alright. I'm almost... I'm running low on these things, like... Why do I get the feeling that in order to get literally everything you need to not use certain things, but eh. If I want a completionist run, I can, you know, play the game again. It's not like I'm that deep into it so far. There we go. Now I can continue to the bridge. Alright, this is my journal. Save the game? Yes. Okay. Ow. God. I really need to stop wasting those things.
How am I supposed to get to that girl over there? Also, there's a hole in the roof there. Hmm. Not waste this shit, okay? Okay, let's put that on there so I don't accidentally waste the rest of my thunder heads, whatever, on that, so. Ah, now I do need to use a Thunderhead. There we go. Okay. There we go. Some more I want to explore over this way. Oh, hey! Okay, I didn't destroy it, so presumably there's something else to... Alright, so we do... we can get more ammo. As a boss. Okay. I'm in danger of dying. I have all this food. So it's just a matter of how long, how many health does this thing have? That was a good hit. Maybe I am in danger of dying. I don't know. As long as I don't move, it seems to be like... I will run low on food. I don't know. How much health does this thing have? Jeez. There we go. Got it. Okay, good. How much 
How has everybody else already passed this? Ah, point of no return, I see. Whoa, what happened here? Oh, what? I hope I don't have to... Oh, no, I have to fight that thing again. Thankfully, I got all my health back... Or, all my food items back, but, like, wow. Really? Yep, I gotta fight it again. Oh, boy. Oh, that worked. That was some good, that was a good chunk of damage. That didn't work. Oh. Come on. Okay. Nope. All right, I just wasted all my ammo. Woo. Beat you once. There we go. Good. Okay. Don't fall in the water this time, Bilbo. It's a perfectly straight bridge. There we go. How? Burglar baggage. There's a light ahead. Go find out what it is. Oh, is this the trolls? I think it might be, the, I think this might be the trolls. Wow, we're, we crept through the forest to discover the source of the light. When he got closer, he discovered it was a campfire. <laughs> trolls, well, I'll prove it's a, I'll prove it my first rate burglar, I pick their pockets. Bilbo, this is, this is a bad idea. What have we, what are you? Bilbo Baggins, a, a hobbit. A poor hobbit, can you cook him? He will make a mouthful, but then more likely we might have a pie. Oh no, please don't cook me, help! What's that noise? We better go see. Quick, get a sack! No more poor hobbits! There are plenty of these here dwarves. What was that in the troll count? Quietly, but the trolls were waiting in the shadows. As each dwarf came up, Pop went a nasty, smelly sack over his head. Dwarves will be delicious roasted. The roast will take all night. Look, it's taking all night. Very well, we'll boil them. We ain't got enough water. Fetch the water if you keep arguing. You're going around. Your booby is on a squash in a jelly. Hey, it's Gandalf. Dawn, take you all and be stoned to you. Came okay, Gandalf's voice. He tricked the trolls into, into arguing until dawn and such and sun. They turned to stone. Stone, they remain to this day. You know, Bilbo released the dwarves from the sacks. That. Find the troll's cave. Okay. Oh god. All the way back here. Well, I mean, at least I have lives again. So... You know, there's that. Alright, well, I will get us through to the trolls before I start the next section. So, 
<sighs> Thank you very much for watching another episode of GBA Let's Play, and I will see you tomorrow with more Planet of the Apes and Friday with more of The Hobbit. See you later.